good. Team exclusive, and welcome back to some more FIFA 21 content today. Of course, we are back with a brand new episode of The Road to Glory. I think today is episode 49, I do believe. So one away from the big 5-0. Not that it really means anything, because it's going to be pretty much the same thing. But uh, yeah, there's been a few things that have been going on. Obviously, I do a lot of stuff in the background, like Silver Stars. I do Silver Beasts in the background, just so... I, I mean, there's no point me showing it on video, unless I'm like, you know... It just, it just seems pointless. It just seems pointless. Um, but yeah, we've done that. Obviously, completed the Silver Stars. Maxime, he looks pointless. Uh, just another one to add to the collection, really. He looks really bad, actually. But uh, it is what it is. Uh, it all obviously counts towards our... Not only our squad battles, the silver, the silver beast does anyway. So we've got 42 left of that till we get an ultimate pack. It's just, it's just a painful grind. It really is, really, really is. Um, yeah, and we've got 26 left to do of this one, which is uh, not too bad, not too bad. Obviously, silver stars do help towards this, so it's always, it's always quite nice to add about three or five more games uh, add to that. So I don't have to play quite so many squad battles games, but yeah. Be a, be a good day when I don't have to ever do that again. But to start things off, of course, there is our Maxman. There's our um, season progress TIFO pointless ship. But we do have the 85 plus the Liga player pick. Now, I'm, I've been quite nervous to actually open this because um, obviously last time we got Luis Suarez. So obviously I wouldn't want to get him again. That would be, uh, that'd be a nightmare. Don't want to get Jesus Navas. That'd be, I mean, it wouldn't be that bad, but it'd just be a bit bit of a kick in the balls but it just feels like and i know the game doesn't work this way it, it doesn't remember your previous packs but i just feel like because we got really lucky in the last one this one surely has to be quite dead i mean i i don't know at this point sure uh i don't know let's open it anyway to find out we've got a few other packs to go through what are we saying team of the yo casemiro that's pretty good to be fair okay i'll take that i'll take that i mean he's not the greatest uh, i don't think he's that amazing um, we'll obviously take him. He's one we haven't got. He actually looks... Well, I mean... He's like 100k. But... Yeah, just for the, like, the players I've got, like Kondogbia. I think Kondogbia is probably better. Um, it's just that pace, man. Really does let him down. Really does let him down. Obviously, two-star, three-star isn't ideal. But yeah. Besides his pace, he's got an exceptional card. Uh, really exceptional. I mean, dribbling's a bit heavy. But uh, yeah. So it's not ideal. Not ideal, but it's one we haven't got, and I'm not going to complain with the 94 team of the season. Obviously, there was an 85, um, 85 times 5 pack, which I just, there's no point doing. It's like an 86 with an inform, I think it is. And yeah, last time, obviously, if you've seen the last video we did with the 85 times 5, we obviously got Iago from the Saudi League. I think it was Saudi League. Yeah, Saudi League team of the season and all 85, so it's literally pointless. Literally pointless. Um, pretty much as pointless as these packs, to be honest. I really don't see the point. But 75 rated player pack. Imagine the scenes. No, 75 rated player pack number two. Imagine the scenes. No, 75 rated player pack number three. Imagine the scenes. No, 75 rated player pack. Number four, imagine the scenes. No. So, it just in my opinion, it's not worth it. So, I'm just going to steer, steer clear and hold out till maybe Bundesliga, team of the season guaranteed, or City A, maybe Ronaldo. I do get an inform out of the rare mega pack. It's going to be... I don't know who that is. I still don't know who that is. Literally no idea. Literally no idea. We do get a Reggie on as well. Where does he even play? He plays in the Polish League. Spanish from... Uh, cool. Wherever that is. I mean, in fairness, he looks pretty... Uh, he looks pretty... Um, pretty bad. So, obviously, he's 88 rated compared to the 94 of Casemiro. But, I mean, obviously, he beats him for pace. Uh, dribbling as well. Shooting. Kondogbia beats him. Passing as well. Physicals are pretty much the same and defending is minus three so literally Kondogbia has everything uh on Casemiro besides defending and physicals and strength 96 99 strength I mean he's got a bit more stamina uh, and jumping and but besides that it's pretty negligible and defending is pretty negligible when it's all over 
like 85s and stuff like that. So, yeah, it's um, it's pretty poor one, in my opinion. It's pretty poor one. If, if EA had boosted him up to like a 95 and just jacked up his pace a bit more uh, and maybe given him like 94 defending, I don't know, something like that. Some, a crazy boost would have been... Um, would have been insane obviously made him a lot more usable but uh yeah at least a couple of games anyway we'll try out some of the new players we've got um which of course being uh obviously suarez from last time who his ratio is looking pretty good <laughs> pretty good four goals three games he um he killed it in the icon swaps friendly mode like long shots are just ridiculous with this guy and obviously coutinho as well is a bit uh it's a bit broken so but why not you know why not we haven't we haven't like I haven't really got the need to try them, but why not try them for for a couple of games? And obviously, we've got the new Icon Moments Laurent Blanc in there as well, and um, yeah, we'll give them a go. Obviously, I might I might swap out Casemiro for Kondogbia um, every so often just to see who's better. Even though I played with this guy quite a lot, um, and he's just insane, absolutely insane with the five star, three star. Not that it really makes much difference, but you know, it, it definitely does help. Um, but yeah, so that's the team. That is... It's a crazy team, isn't it? It's a crazy good team. It's changed a lot, though. It's changed a lot. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I, I didn't actually think I'd find someone better than Thierry Henry, but I do think Luis Suarez might just be that player. So we'll see. Anyway, first game, if it does ever actually want to load. There we go. Well, it finally did load, but I fucking know it's gone. He's got a good team. Um, it's, I mean, it's not. It's an odd team. It's got obviously that headline as Benzema with Casemiro, and a standard. Uh, yep, we could uh, definitely have seen that one coming. All right, so here we go for game number two. I kind of wish I'd played the first guy now. Holy shit! Prime R9 Ronaldo. Team of the seasons galore. So he's got those uh, foot champion red team of the seasons. I don't think he changed um, Fakir to like a centre forward or anything. It was a bit weird. A bit odd. But, I mean, it is what it is at this point. Jesus Christ. I don't know if this guy's good or not. We could be in for a little bit of a battering. But, I mean... The, 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 okay. I mean, the lag right now is something really special, isn't it? My God. Brilliant. Yeah, cool. I'm just going to leave this game. I, I'm not, um, I'm not, uh, yeah, I'm not, I'm not too fast. So, um, it just li literally unplayable, unplayable. That's a bit, that's a bit odd. I didn't even click advance and it just took me into the game. Very strange. Anyway, playing against uh, two people. So uh, you do love to see it. It's got, it's got a nice looking team to be fair. Got that Didier Drogba, SCN Benzema. It's a good team to be fair. Hopefully it's um, slightly less laggy as the other one was. Go on, Kaka. Like, why is it so laggy today? What the fuck is happening? Literally can't do anything. Like, what is that? I didn't even know when the ball was coming to me because it just stopped. It's like a stop motion film. This is fucking insane. Go on, Suarez. What a finish by Luis Suarez. You do love to see it. I kind of messed it up because I just kind of pressed it. I didn't really put any power to behind it, but he just he just slotted it straight in the back of the net. That is things you do love to see. Not quite the ball I was asking for, but... Oh, he got it through as well. What a finish by Philippe Coutinho. You do love to see it. Kaka getting the ball through. Absolutely sensational stuff. Lauren Blanc just... Being an absolute rock in the defence. Great job, Casemiro. Let's go. Nah. It's, it's so sad, that is. That is so sad. Go on. Coutinho! There we go. Makes it three. The, the, no, nah, I'm sorry. It actually annoys me how these people play. Like, it's the same shit every single time. And they managed to score with Benzema to get one lucky goal. I just don't get it, man. Just don't get it. But it is what it is. Oh, look at Casemiro go. I'm sorry, like, he, he's meant to be slow as shit. But he's fully rapid, man. 
Good job, didn't they? See, baited out the fucking pass there as well. You do love to see it. Straight through to Kaka. Gonna get through to Suarez. Hmm. Oh, Sane's away. You ain't gonna stop him. Sane, fresh legs. Bang. Bang. The Palsy can't quite get it in the back of the net, though. That kind of sucks. I wonder where he's going to go now. Oh, was, he did try and go down the right, but he's offside, so... Got to learn how that rule works, I'm afraid, bud. Sane. Go on, Sane. How has he missed that? That's crazy. Doesn't really matter, though, at this point, does it? Because he's going to try and go down the right again. Oh. How about no? Oh, what? How about no? <laughs> And there we go, so the most boring set of people I've ever fucking seen in my life. Holy shit. Jesus Christ. But uh, there we go, so what was it 3-1? Suarez with 1, Coutinho with 2, you do love to see it. 1 assist from Kaka and Coutinho, 1 assist from uh, Luis Suarez. Big things you do love to see, you do love to see it. Alright, so what I'm going to do for this game, for the second one, is I'm just going to swap out Casemiro for uh, Michael Essien. Seems like a bit of a no-brainer, but uh, I actually didn't mind Casemiro. He's actually quite good, uh, especially against those guys. But again, don't know if that was the fairest comparison because they weren't that great. But um, yeah, he was actually pretty good. He felt a lot quicker than he actually portrays on his card. Uh, like 78 pace, he felt like he was like 84, 85, that kind of mark. Not really rapid, but... He kept up with a lot of people, a lot of quick people on the ball. He, he was definitely um, up there with keeping keeping in track of them. So I actually don't mind it. It's actually it's actually a good card. So yeah, probably not better than Michael Essi and Izzy though. Prime Michael Moments. Let's face it. He, he did read it to be fair. Uh, oh, I shouldn't really have scored that. I felt really bad to be fair. I do feel bad. That's such a shit goal to concede. I'd be really annoyed with that, but. Um, uh, you know, unfortunately, if it comes that way, you've just got to take it, sadly. That's the way the game goes. Um, but yeah, I do I do feel for that because it's happened to me so many times. See if we can actually get a half-decent goal this time. Yo, Suarez is breaking through the middle again. Can he? Nope. Can we get that again? Can. Go on. Endombele from the hell. Oh my god, that was a rocket. Kind of passed himself, which I didn't really want to do. But Lauren Blanc... Straight at the keeper. Oh, you do love to see it. Oh, no. I saw the defender and I thought I could get it straight past him, but that fucking sucks. I'm kidding. Oh, my God. How has that still gone in? How has that still gone in? That's insane. I had my player right there in front of him and everything. Like, what more do I have to actually do? Oh, and Coutinho bangs it in the back of the net. Some nice skill just to uh, completely drop the defender. You do love to see it. And then we'll get we're seeing the bridges again. Cool. You do love to see it. Go on. Bridge me again. I dare you to. Yeah, fuck you. Oh, that's a good ball as well. Coutinho's dropped him. Bang! For a second for Coutinho. This guy's an absolute monster. Just completely in front of the defender. And he still gets the ball off him. That's ridiculous. Oh, go on. From there, Coutinho. Hit the post as well. Mad. Mad. Nope. Oh, he's actually got it as well. That kind of sucks for this guy. But we'll take it. Take it. The amount of times this guy's bridged me, I really have stopped caring. <laughs> And there's another one. Like, what are we doing? Is it just Bridge City? Bridge City around here. Fuck me. Nice. Good effort. Good effort, bud. We're all, uh, all really proud of you for that one. Come on, Suarez. Finish it. There we go. 6-1. My god. I mean, this at this point, this guy's just embarrassing himself. How the fuck... Fair enough. I mean, he's got a third back. Fair play to him. At least he's not bridging anymore, which is slightly more respectable. Yeah, 
fucking Clark Harris. Absolute monster. You do love to see it. Love this guy. Oh. Ishmael Asar. Can't get himself a goal. What? How did he not score that? That's insane. Go on. You do love to see it. Clark Harris. He can't score it either. This Courtois is actually having a mad one right now. Go on. Bang. Okay, watch this. First time. Boom. Oh. I mean, it's a penalty anyway, but I mean, it fully fucking lagged, so I couldn't see what the fuck was going on. But, uh... Okay. <sighs> okay. Can't win that. Bang. <sighs> yeah, well, that was going in as well. Watch this. Bang. Bang. What? Well, uh, the guy really, he really wanted to score for some reason. Really wanted to score fourth. I've no idea why. But uh, there we go. So, 7 3. I mean, the game kind of. The, the guy lost his head really once it went past about like 5 something, 5 1. Um, and it wasn't really a competitive game of football at that point, was it really? But um, yeah, 5 goals for Coutinho. You do love to see it. Five uh, actual goals, not just um, when we were pissing about. Like he actually scored five goals against. From what I could see, the guy was actually trying, but maybe he wasn't. Uh, one from Suarez, one from Clark Harris. Probably could have had a lot more if I was actually trying a bit harder. Uh, same with Saar, got an assist. Kaka got an assist. Coutinho and Suarez with three. Nice. That's how the team's gonna rock for the last episode. I've stuck in Juan Bissaka again, uh, put him back in the right back position. He just, I don't know, Hazel Stavis is good, but he's one of those players, it's literally just like putting a really, it's just putting a body in the right right back position uh, who can run really, really quickly. It's pretty much all he's there for. Um, doesn't have much ability besides just running really quickly. So, I don't know, but here we go. So, game number three. It's a nice team, actually. It's a very nice team. It's a very team of the season team. Come on, man. I've blocked... I'm in front of him again, man. Like, what the fuck is that? What is the point? Like, what is the point in defending? You get your player in the right position and he still manages to score it. It's actually ridiculous. He's done me there as well. Like, I just can't deal with it. I can't deal with it. Um, Just players not making tackles and shit. It's, fu it's fucked, man. It's actually fucked. Coutinho, there we go, and Coutinho can bang it in the back of it. Oh my god, this is a, it's a tough, it's a, it's a frustrating game because like I know I can like do something against this guy, and obviously we have scored, so I have kind of proven that. Like we're defending well, even though we have conceded three, but it's just like I just want the game just to let me do my thing basically. Um, yeah, they just passes aren't going where I want them to and, and stuff like that, so. It's just fantastic. Suarez, go on. Go on, Suarez. How has he not scored it? Why has he hit it straight at the fucking keeper? What an absolute donut. Yeah. I was fucked there. I was absolutely fucked. It's just like, it's so bad. So, so bad. Oh my, I don't know how there's a penalty. This game is fucked, man. Guaranteed this won't even go in. Guaranteed. Okay, thank God he didn't stay down the middle. Holy shit. Uh, and apparently I gave away a penalty now. Brilliant, cool. I guess it's an eye for an eye and all that, isn't it? But Jesus. <sighs> okay. Fair enough, I guess. Fair enough. Guess it's one that you just can't uh, can't reach. Now this Courtois is actually uh, actually insane. <laughs> I can't I can't put the ball past him. Gonzalo Campbell, nope. Hmm. Uh, 
fantastic. Uh, and not that it mattered. I mean, that was the shittest ball I've actually ever seen in my entire life. Insane. I actually do want to see how many saves this Courtois made because I, I had so many chances. 17. And he obviously got man of the match for it. 10.0. Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Yeah, so I've uh, I, I've gone out and taken the executive decision to uh, hopefully start and complete. Hopefully, I'm, I mean, it's an A A4, isn't it? So should be able to complete it quite easily. But I'm going to try and complete the Thibaut Courtois. It has nothing to do with the previous game. It has everything to do with the previous game. <laughs> okay, so there we go. There we go. And Thibaut Courtois has been... Uh, has been completed. I gave up Jesus Navas. 94 rated. I mean, I used him a little bit. I think he's I think he's okay, to be honest. I think he's okay. He is super, super weak, and you do notice it. But uh, if you want somebody with just pace and nothing really else going on kind of up here, then you know he's probably uh it's probably your your type of man. But after I played against this Thibaut Quarter and he saved literally 17 shots um from everybody, then uh, I, I knew I kind of had to go out and go out and complete him. He looks really good um obviously obviously yeah there we go and he is quite cheap as well you know 84 rated squad nowadays if you do a lot of upgrade packs is not bad is not bad at all so yeah but if you imagine like with a basic which he's got plus fives across the board that's 97 100 85 100 56 97 so it's basically 99 everything i've never seen that one before i've never seen the europa league Molten ball. It's obviously quite common, but I've never actually seen it. It looks actually really nice as well, surprisingly. Uh, just get rid of those. You do love to see it. Okay. Not bad, to be fair. Not bad. And uh, maybe, what, like 9,000 coins maybe off Falverde? Which is always very, very nice. No walkout, no boards in a final one. It does kind of suck, but it is what it is. What do we get? Burgreece. Trying to look out for like Portuguese players as well. Power. What's his first name? Max Power. Of course it is. Max Power. Anybody with the surname Power is obviously going to have the first name of Max. And there we go. So there is another episode of The Road to Glory done. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed it. Um, I think hopefully as long as that Thibaut Courtois is, is just as good as he was uh, as he was against us for us, then um, we're in... it's a sign, isn't it? That um, now that we've got him, He'll be complete trash. He'll be complete trash for us, guaranteed. But uh, yeah, there we go. So hopefully you have enjoyed. Um, if you have, of course, please do drop it a like. That'll always, and of course, be very, very much appreciated. Uh, drop us a comment if you want to. Um, you know, let me know what you thought of the episode and all that kind of stuff. Um, well, and of course, if you haven't already, do consider hitting that subscribe button um, and become part of the exclusive family. But with that said, I do hope you enjoyed. Thank you very much for watching and as always, we'll see you next time.